So I ended up not having enough footage for the other four photo shoots. So you have Eva that already has her own BTS video on the channel. And now it's Alize's turn. So these are the only two models that will have their own behind the scenes video on this YouTube channel. For the other four sessions, you will have to go to the blog and go premium. They will be available this Saturday at the latest. What's interesting is how each session made in the same apartment are really different. There are, of course, a few similar shots made with the same setups, but each model brought their own flavor, and so I had to adapt. It was our first time working together. It took us a few minutes to outfits to be precise, to get in our groove. And we did mainly a mix of optical snoots and a basic four light setup. Basic because almost each time I had two strips in the back of my model, a small modifier with the grid at the top and the para 128 as my main or fill light above my head and my back or close to the model. And for the gear, the tools that I used for all six photo shoots, it was always the same. I had the GFX 102, the GF 110, GF 80, GF 55. For my flashes, I had the 80 1200 Pro, two of them, 8600 Pro and 8300 Pro. Now you have all the ingredients, all the main ones. Let's see what we cooked this time.
yesterday I shared with you on this channel a review sort of first hands-on Vilawa Proteus anamorphic lenses. It was an opportunity for me to test them but also to create two micro short dance films with only these lenses. So I updated my second YouTube channel so if you haven't been there in a while you might have missed not two but maybe three dance videos there and I'm posting sharing a new one tomorrow which will be the last one of the year so be sure not to miss it. So I'm still going to post stuff before Christmas so stick around please. So I guess that I will catch you in the next one. Until then take care and please have a good one.